Hello, Oculus. Welcome to Viva Barca and welcome to another interesting episode where we are going to be discussing on some of the freshest updates on FC Barcelona. Before we get going, I want to say a big thank you to all my returning subscribers. If you are just coming across this channel for the first time, if you haven't subscribed, please make sure to subscribe. In this episode, we are going to be discussing on some two developing stories. We are going to begin with this interview from this um, Barcelona's Economic Vice President, Edward Romero. Of course, we'll give some positive updates when it comes to our wage limits or let me say our wage cap. And of course, complying with La Liga's fair play rules. As he just said that, you know, um, Barcelona still have room, you know, on their wage bill to register new players this coming January while staying within La Liga's financial fair play rules. He was having an interview with Spanish TV, TV3. We are going to be discussing much more on what he said. Then to conclude, we are going to be talking about Ronald Arao. As Barcelona have just released an official statement confirming that he picked up a hamstring injury while on international duty. And of course, they are saying that he will return to Barcelona for treatment. And we don't know how long he will be out with an injury. But Barcelona said that when the doctors in Barcelona will assess it, then they will give you know, an update on the number of weeks that Arau can miss. But for sure, he will miss the El Clasico and the Valencia game that are upcoming. We are going to be discussing on that. So guys, as we get ready to discuss those stories in more detail, please make sure to subscribe to the channel. If you haven't subscribed, give this video a like and make sure to watch this video right up to the very end. Speaking in an interview with TV3, Barcelona's economic vice president Edward Romero has claimed that the club have room on their wage bill to register new players in January while staying within La Liga's financial fair play rules. Barcelona were put through the you know the ringer during the summer transfer window as their massive wage bill meant that they had to lose club legend Messi and a number of other players and bring in only a handful of new signings. You know, Barca even struggled to register those who came in and needed their captains to take pay cuts in order to make it possible while staying within La Liga's limits. However, the late exit of Antoine Griezmann and the salary reduction of three of the four captains has created room for Barcelona to make new investments in January transfer window. Indeed, Romero speaking to TV3 has confirmed that Barca have around 20 million euros to spend on new players while conforming with their fair play rules. Going by his words, we still have room for fair play to register players. We have about 20 million euros. It is a figure that is beginning to be important and that we could consume to bring the player or players more suitable for the places that the technical team decides, he said. You know, so plans for the January transfer window are already afoot at the Camp Nou as Barcelona are said to be keen on bringing in a new central midfielder and a forward. You know, there have also been speculations surrounding the future of Ousmane Dembele as his contract situation remains unresolved. If that does not change, the Frenchman could be shown the exit doors. You know, which would free up further space on the payroll and generate more funds to splash as well. It remains to be seen who Barcelona decides to bring in a January window. A lot of things could depend on who the manager for the club would be at that time, with Ronald Koeman's job still very much insecure. Then moving on to the next topic of discussion, Barcelona have been hit with another injury blow during the international break as Ronald Araujo has picked up a hamstring injury playing for Uruguay. The centre-back was taken off in the second half of his team's 3-0 defeat to Argentina and will miss their World Cup qualifier with Brazil. Araujo will return to Barcelona where he will undergo further tests on the problem. Here is Barcelona's official statement. Tests carried out by the Uruguayan Football Association's medical department have confirmed that first-teamer Ronald Araujo picked up a right hamstring injury during the match against Argentina on Sunday. He will return to Barcelona where the club's medical department will assess his injury. You know, Barcelona will be hoping the injury is not too serious with Araujo having emerged as a key player in the early weeks of the season after some strong performances. His injury also comes as a bad time, you know, at a bad time with key games against Valencia, Dinamo Kiev and Real Madrid to come next week for Ronald Koeman's side. Of course, Koeman does have plenty of options with Garcia, Mingueza, Lenglet and Umtiti, all options to replace Araujo. So guys, with that we come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching and I hope you did enjoy the video. 
If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please make sure to subscribe so you always stay up to date with the best updates on FC Barcelona here on Viva Barca. Until next time, bye bye.